Today, students at a local elementary school had a Zoom call with a very popular predictor. News 4's Hope Winter is in Boston as students learn more about Punxsutawney Phil right before Groundhog Day. But also, like said, to be able to see him up close and personal, ask questions and learn more about him and his handlers was pretty, pretty, pretty neat for them. He was so cute. Boston Valley Elementary was one of hundreds of schools throughout the nation that had the chance to see the famous Punxsutawney Phil and his inner circle before he makes his annual prediction. <laughs> An opportunity for students to learn more about the magic and tradition of Groundhog Day, but also for their teachers to relate the tradition to lessons learned right in the classroom. I learned that he eats vegetables and fruit like us. Because it's a great way for us to look outside of our local community. So we learn about Puxatani, Pennsylvania, um, and what's really cool is people from all over the world come every single year. Um, as the handler shared today, some people come once, some people come every single year, but to be able to expand their um, exposure beyond and learn about different people from different cultures and what they do in their community is pretty cool. After meeting Phil himself, there's a big question on everyone's mind. Will Phil see a shadow? No. I love you, it's pretty early. I love winter, <laughs> so I kind of hope he does see a shadow. Yeah. <laughs> I want it to be spring early. I do not think he's going to see a shadow. I like the warm weather, don't yeah. I? So yeah, we're looking too. forward to some sunny days on the playground. Yeah. Whether he sees his shadow or not, tens of thousands of people will fill Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania with all eyes on Phil. And his newest fans will be tuning in to see their new furry friend from hundreds of miles away, continuing the tradition for the next generation. In Boston, Hope Winter, News 4.